For binary search one, we suppose we are performing a binary search on a sorted array initialized as follows. For this example, binary search one, we suppose we are performing a binary search on a sorted array initialized as follows. And we are supposed to write the indexes of the element that would be examined by the binary search. This would be the mid values in our algorithm's code and write the value that would be returned from the search. If we have this array and it's passed into this binary search with the value 18 that we need to find, we can first look over a code and see if our 18 is in here. There is no 18, so it would return a negative one. This part right, however, we haven't done the first part. And the reason why the first part's not filled out is because we need to look at all of the indexes it examines. Our first indexes are gonna be the far left and far right, and this is going to be the minimum. This is gonna be the max, and our middle is gonna be the sum of these two divided by two, which is gonna be seven. That means that our first value examined is seven. Since our value that we are looking at is 18, we know that it cannot be greater than the value at seven, which is 24. So that means all of this we get rid of. Now we need to make a new min value, which would still be the same in this case. We need to make a new max value, which would be this value, and a new middle value, which would be this value. So we're examining index three. It's still not here. We see the value at index three is three, which is less than 18. So that means this side would cancel out and we have to look at these values right here. Now we have to make a new minimum value, which will be here. Our max value is going to stay the same and our new middle value is going to be this. This means we have the index five, which is our new middle value and the value 14 we can see that this isn't the value that we want. We want 18. So we have to now look between these two. 19 is going to be our new min, mid, and max after this. And since all of our min, mid, and max are stacked into one index, that means we've reached the end of our binary search. And the indexes we have examined are seven, three, five, and six.